Welcome back to Good Day, everyone. I'm here with Tiffany Stewart, who might just be not only the busiest lady in Southwest Georgia right now, but probably one of the most popular. She is the product sales manager for Region 4, which is here in Southwest Georgia, and she is in charge of Girl Scout cookies, which I, I'm just, you must have been so busy these past few days. Yes, we <laughs> have been delivering all across Southwest Georgia since last Wednesday. So Goodness. initial delivery ended yesterday. So wow. um, if it wasn't for my delivery guys um, that's based out of Tifton, um, these, these troops wouldn't have the cookies that we have. Now, when we say, you know, of course, the, the Girl Scout that I ordered them will be delivering them to me hopefully soon. Um, I keep forgetting to, to bring my money in for her, but how, how does it work? Where do the Girl Scout cookies come from? Because you mentioned down in Tifton. Right, there, uh, Hutchinson Moving and Storage is, is where um, the bakery delivers my cookies. Okay. So they're my where, local warehouse uh, in and around our area. But they, these cookies actually get made in Kentucky and and they get shipped down to my warehouse in Tipton. I bet that is a very, very popular bakery. <laughs> yes, <laughs> they probably got it this is. secret recipe <laughs> that no one can know. Uh, but of course, we've got all the different flavors of cookies here. Savannah Smiles, are those the new ones this year? Um, actually, those are um, those were new last year. Okay. So we just kept them on board this this year for um, for our sixth variety. Love it, love it. And are there a couple missing? I know there are the, the staples this year. Um, yeah, we're we're part of a Super Six program, so we only sell six varieties, and we have our five core um, cookies that we sell every year and then our six cookies so good you can't get rid of them <laughs> which our six cookie is um, the Savannah smiles again this year okay. so we will always have our core cookies um, what we call them in Girl Scouts I love it because they're the best <laughs> now what is your favorite cookie my favorite cookie is probably the tag along the tag alongs okay. yes I, I like all of them I gotta say though I did find a box it's not a full box it's like three cookies left <laughs> of thin mints in my freezer from last year so I think that's pretty good yes I didn't didn't eat them all but right now I want to talk about and we'll get into more of this later here on good day but operation cookies from home yes that's such a wonderful program that our girls participate in every year across the store Georgia mm -hmm. um, it's a way for girls to um, have community service project so they advertise those when they do individual sales mm -hmm. um, and then when they are out doing booth sales as the booth sales start today so great. it's and a great program it's an opportunity for girls to send or anyone I guess to right. send cookies to troops overseas right so if you're trying to watch your watch your diet and you, and you need to send and you want to be a part of a great community service project donate a box of cookies um, to go to our operations cookies from home I love it then not only are you putting a smile on the soldiers face but also again as you said helping out the girls right here at home we've got yes. lots more including how you can still buy Girl Scout cookies because you're not out of time yet but first we're gonna hand it on over to Kelly Thank all right thanks Kelly well we are here with the busiest and probably most popular lady in town this this season I guess you could say Tiffany Stewart is uh, the product sales manager for the Girl Scouts and I say season because I mean it should be a holiday <laughs> Girl yes. Scout cookies are here and today booth sales start correct? yes today is a very big day in Girl Scouting booth sales start all across our community and all across the store of Georgia today so exciting so booth sales for people who don't know are it's where girls are out in front of local businesses in and around our community at both locations at Walmart Lowe's Home Depot um, Hobby Lobby, Sam's, Winn-Dixie. So troops will be out this afternoon and all weekend long um, selling their Girl Scout cookie. Great. So much fun. I was a Girl Scout when I was younger and I just loved booth sales. You get to get out there, interact with the community, of course sell the Girl Scout cookies and just have fun with your troop. But right. when it comes to selling the Girl Scout cookies, of course the community gets to pack on a few extra pounds. Yes. <laughs> but it's also really a, a good learning experience for these girls. It is. They're, they're taught five basic skills um, in and around their troop meetings so um, they're very prepared to answer any questions that customers may have so I encourage customers to ask these girls what their goal is um, what they're trying to strive as a troop Great. And Girl Scouts, the whole foundation is to, to grow up wonderful women for our community. And these right. are kind of business lessons that they're learning here at this young stage. Yes, this is the largest girl-led business in the entire world. Wow. So this is a very big deal for girls. This, is, this gets them ready for, for future endeavors in which they ever 
certainly want to pursue so Who knows? get them ready. Maybe it'll be a CEO of That's a company right. one day and it That's all right. started with Girl Scout cookies. That's right. Talking about money though, how does the, how does each troop decide what to do? Each troop decides on how they spend their um, their profit in their own different ways. So right. the girls really are a part of that decision making process with their troop leaders. So they go anywhere from trips to go abroad mm -hmm. um, to explore what, what else is out there in the world. And Fun. plus um, some troops, you know, just donate back to local community local yeah, charities and their community. Okay, so boost sales start today. When yes. do they wrap up? When do we need to buy all our cookies? The by? last day to buy cookies is March the 10th around in and around our community at boost sales. Okay, so that's coming up pretty that soon. Is, it's going to be fast. here before we know it. And folks who uh, might not be able to buy Girl Scout cookies for themselves are, of course, soldiers who are overseas. So the Girl Scouts have Operation Cookies from Home project yes. going on. Yes, that is a wonderful community service project that all Girl Scouts of Historic Georgia participate in. So if, if they don't want to buy a box of cookies for themselves, they're more than welcome to donate a box to send our men and women so overseas. Special. So, so special. Get out there this afternoon, support those girls in our community. Now we're going to hand it on over to Chris.